Okay, here we sit with the wheeler in the garage and the bent tie rod. Yeah, we'll take care of that. Here's a tie rod in here off that uh, rear wheel drive um, ZJ. So I'm just gonna steal the tie rod off of this guy and uh, you know, put that on the wheeler. We gotta go wheeling this weekend, so it's gotta happen fast instead of fabbing something up. So here we go. Not much left to that nut. Ew. Now it's time for the magic whack. Winning. Victory! Oh yeah! Here's the tie rod that we stole off the donor Jeep off that front axle, that two-wheel drive axle. And we'll put her right on there. Fix her right up. Got a wheeling event coming up this weekend that I've done since I was like nine years old. So. Better keep the streak alive and keep going. So we're just gonna throw this used tie rod in and put her in here for the weekend and someday we'll upgrade this steering system to some beefier stuff. But for now, that one goes in. Seriously can't make this stuff up. First I broke the bit in there. Now I broke the punch in there. Come on. There you go. A drill bit, a punch later, and we got her. Oh, can you see it? There she be.
Here is the banana tie rod. And a stock tie rod. A little bit of difference. So that's a wrap. A little dirt there. Tie rod on. She's all ready to go. Greased each side after I installed it. And now we're good. Just Man, that's a great surprise. Yes. Take up. Right now. Do I stop? <laughs>